Next, we're going to try and get the internal resistance of this little coin cell. It's in a holder with banana plugs. So I'll unplug from the big hobby battery that we used and plug in just the voltmeter onto the coin cell and connect bingalo. We're up to, now it's dropping, dropping. Let's see if it gets steady. 1.92 volts. If I leave it going, it'll drain and probably go down lower, but I want to get the steady voltage that it's on right there. And then these, these are nominally three volts, so this one's a pretty dead one. And then we have a higher internal resistance. So again, I'll connect the meter in parallel to the voltmeter. I'm sorry, I'll connect the, the resistor box in parallel to the voltmeter. I'll take the voltage up again, or the uh, resistance up 8,000. 765 just to start. So if I connect that, the voltage drops, it stabilizes. Okay, the resistance is 8765 and the voltage is about 0 0.5675, 1.75 volts. One point seven three. It's really dropping. I'll go down to six thousand. I don't want to keep this connected to drain the battery, so I'm going to lower the resistance, connect it, make a reading. I do want it to settle down. Six thousand seven hundred and sixty-five ohms at one point one eight volts. I'll unhook the switch. I'll go down to 4,654 ohms just for fun. Connect it. It's dropping 1.62 volts. 3,333 ohms. Voltage goes up quickly and then drops down to 1.55 volts. 2,222 ohms. Let's just drop it. It's up 1.5, 1.45 volts. 1,111 ohms. I'll connect it again. And 1.2, let's say 1.2 ohms. The last few digits don't matter because we're going to average or plot a graph depending on how we do the analysis. I'm at 1,100. I'm going to go down to 700, just 700 ohms. I'll take a few more. 600, 700 ohms gives me one volt. I think I'm going to stop there. We got enough data, I think, that if, if the model holds and there really is a, a meaningful internal resistance in this, then we should have enough data to do it. And if it doesn't line up to match the model, then we will have found it. So that's enough data for that.